Hey guys, and welcome to the free Unity assets for September 2020. Now, I know it's October at the time of recording this, but I always have to do a month behind because obviously the October assets will not be available. So, this month is an absolute crazy amount actually, it might be the most I've ever seen, 98 different free assets. The first one is the Restaurant Little Pack. And this is essentially a pack for a small little restaurant game with a stylized look with between 12 and 1200 triangles and it includes 76 different restaurant prefabs including particular pieces for walls, interiors, doors, props and all the things you see here. The second one is the controlled fly light and this is a particular set of scripts which allow you to simulate the movement of flying objects when they have to have interesting and different behavior, can be aircraft or missiles and allows natural movements of animals or birds. The next one is the obstacle course pack and this is quite a nice one which comes with a bunch of let's say if you were doing a clone of Fall Guys and allow you to have moving platforms, fall through objects, have spinning things, have a, a hammer which knocks you around, loads and loads of different things there. So the next one is the Nature HDRIs 4K and I think HDR Haven, whether I've not before, I've featured it on the channel and these give free HDRI and Skybox materials. You could check out their website but they seem to have appeared on the Unity store recently. So they've got a crazy amount of free Skyboxes that have especially appeared this month. This one specifically includes 203 high quality original HDRIs and you can see it's massive because it's 4.2 gigabytes. The next one is something called the Essential Scripts for Games and this just has I thought I would include it because it has a bunch of uh, specific beginner scripts for having a random sound and a collision, being able to switch camera views, have a simple FPS counter, being able to control rotation of objects, creating a flashlight with sound, trigger events. The next one is the Pine Forest set free sample. So this is a set which includes eight unique stylized assets suitable for a specific hand painted or handcrafted style. Three trees, one rock, one bush, three branches and eight unique assets with textures up to 4K resolution. The next one is the pre 2D mega pack and this includes 230 free 2D game assets which includes backgrounds, environments, animated characters, enemies, items, icons, tools and weapons, platforms, food parts and a whole bunch of stuff from there. The next one is the Space Adventure Endless Game Template and this is a template for an endless sort of they say runner for iOS or Android devices specifically for mobile which allow which include a level loader, animations, and be able to add new obstacles, different parts for upgrading with all the gameplay, the settings, the sound and music and something to have a look and see how it's made. The next one is the Stylized Environment Free Pack. And this includes two rocks, one crystal, one tree and a demo scene with textures up to 1000 resolution with an average of 271 polygons. The next one is the screenshot utility and this is a utility in Unity directly in there so you can capture high quality resolution screenshots with whatever you're looking at and you can adjust the actual settings and look at what the format should be in the simple dialog prompt. The next one is the Propane Tank HDRP, three different types of LODs up to from 2000 to 6000 triangles with 4K textures suitable for a HDRP setup. The next one is the recyclable scroll list. So you can create scroll lists in Unity, which allow you to create obviously lists, inventories, things like that. But this allows you to create a recyclable scroll list. So your scroll list could have a thousand different elements and if you did it in the original without being able to destroy and reuse some of the assets that you've already got, you might lose a lot of performance. So this allows you to recycle some of the points which you won't see off screen and keep it very performant and you can have this for vertical, horizontal and grid layout. The next one is something called Auto Mover and it's a component which allows you to create the movement of objects. An Auto Mover is an easy way to create paths and things for objects that don't require heavy interaction, things like stars in the background or things that would move independent of something else. And last but not least is something called the Boris Monster and I'm sure Boris Johnson doesn't look like this but maybe transforms under his skin and it's a monster suitable with a PBR setup with around 10,000 triangles with 12 different animations for attack, idle, walk, walk back, death and 
getting hit. So be sure to check out all of these fantastic assets and the other ones that I haven't featured in this video and you can check all of them out in the description. Make sure you check out the community discord, check out all my great assets on the Unity store and support me on Patreon if you're looking to support the channel. So thanks very much for watching, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. Cheers.